There are large chunks of scripture in which we sometimes think, why is this possibly in the Bible? What can I possibly get out of this? Well, there are many things I think we can learn from the production of the materials for the tabernacle, the arrangement of the items, the rituals established. The one thing I want to focus in on is Exodus 25, verse 9. It says, exactly as I show you concerning the pattern of the tabernacle and of all of its furniture, so you shall make it. The thing is, God had given the Israelites a very specific plan in how to prepare the place in which they would meet with him. They couldn't construct the tabernacle how they wanted it to be. They needed to make it the way that God wanted it to be, or else it wouldn't please Him. A lot of people in the world today want to approach God and, and worship God however they want to. But that's not what God wants for them. God has given us a very specific way to approach God, and it's through faith in Jesus Christ. Our worship is only acceptable to God when it's through faith in Jesus Christ, our Savior. As you worship God, thank God for what Jesus did for you on the cross, so that you could be pleasing to Him.